Previously on E's 9 Monstrum Nox, the party did a Nerd Prison Break mission, which included a Nerd Trap Build dungeon for the non Monstrum at all. The person of interest turned out to be Seneschal Lucian, who was imprisoned for questioning Chalard's abuse of his powers. In the, in the Entertainment District, Yufa is forced to transform into Raging Bull in order to save her boyfriend Felix from a Berserk Bull, and it looks like a powerful boss monster was the one responsible for scaring the bull. Oh, missed me already, handsome? You seem to be in quite a hurry. Is everything alright? Perhaps I may be able to help. Well, count yourself lucky then. Still, you look like you could use some rest. Oh, before I forget, I have something for you. Take it or not, it's entirely up to you. I have a special potion here I'd like for you to try. Think of it as a token of our friendship. I completed it after setting the medicinal herbs native to Balduke. Just like a spell of love, it has the power to re reinvigorate you from any fatigue you may have. Don't be shy, take some. I have plenty for your friends too. I'll give it a try my friends. Thanks, but no thanks. We only live off healing points. No. I see, that's a shame. Come see me anytime you change your mind. I'll always make time for you, handsome. Seems I have to actually take it to advance the quest, huh? Oh, have I changed your heart? I knew you'd be back for my wonderful potion. Like a spell of love, it has the power to reinvigorate you from any fatigue you may have. I do recommend it, especially for someone who clearly has a lot going on. I'm going to try with my friends. Heh, <laughs> I do like a man who's willing to try new things. Think of it as a prescription. Don't go anywhere, handsome. I'll fetch the potion for you. You and your allies guard shortly after. Everyone prepared to drink the special potion that Sarati so generously offered. But what about Dahl? Actually, how does Dahl even heal off of food items anyway? Upon removing the bottle cap, a sweet honey-like aroma wafts from the flask. Whoa, it smells delicious. Well, don't mind if I do. Whatever it takes to be in tip-top shape, you know? This scent, it's familiar. Not all medicine has to be bitter, I figured. So why not make it taste good? Now please, enjoy it. Ah, oh, that was delicious, and it's true, I feel great. Wonderful, you have a splendid appetite. I'm happy you approve. I simply wanted to extend my friendship to a few captivating individuals such as yourselves. And I find you especially captivating, Adol Kristen, adventurer and fugitive. Huh? Hey, how do you know he was Adol? I mean, oops. You just told me, sweetheart. I'm glad I wasn't mistaken. Imagine how silly I'd look otherwise. The disguise suits you, and this confirms what I'm looking for is nearby. The hell? What's going on? My head. Hey, sweet dreams, cutie pies. But doll should not be affected, right? Z. Hey, rise and shine, cowgirl. Yawn. What, what have I... What's going on? Trante and the customers, too. It appears as if everyone is asleep, but I just did the contents of that potion we were given were laced with sedatives. Sedatives? Yes, there's an herb just like at my flower shop that has a sleep-inducing effect. The ones that grow in glia can really be potent if extracted and processed properly. I barely tasted it, but I could tell it was the same variety. I don't know what that hussy's up to, but she ain't getting away with this, I promise that. She went down to the basement. I'm going after her. I wasn't the only one who fell for it, was I? Don't worry about it. What's important is that we find her. Yeah, and we can't let our fellow monstrums go, go it alone. That vile lair is gonna get what's coming to her. Hey, Adol, good to see you guys are alright. Z, snort. Dad, gonna make you proud. Professor Valen. She got you all too? Looks like I wasn't the only one. Yep, she came down here and gave each of us a smell of some weird concoction. The two of us resisted its effects somehow, but we couldn't catch her when she ran. She definitely didn't move like any doctor I've ever that I've seen. Must have used the same substance the others were affected by. I see, just smelling it can make you sleepy, but not as sleepy as actually ingesting it. You gonna tell us where she went? Uh, about that. When was this here? Whoa, was there always a passage here? It appears to extend to a large chamber. But how does she know about this? 
Only way to find out is to tie her up and make her spill the beans. She's going to answer for pulling a fast one of the monstrums on their own turf. Well, stay here with them, Togi. I got this. I'll keep an eye on the customers at the bar, too. We're counting on you guys. All that glare is accepted. I can't believe this was underneath the bar the whole time. Our primary objective is the capture of the culprit. This structure appears to be of ancient origin. Let us be mindful of traps. Oh no, just like in the prison area. Lead the way with your gift, Anemona. Allow me. Let's go! Okay, slime type enemies. Okay, that takes care of that. A treasure chest. Crimson spar. Huh. Wait, which way's the right way to go? Hmm. Huh. Something's there. Life elixir. This can't be. Was I mistaken? Then why is that adventurer? There you are. It's you. So that's how it is. Adol Kristen and his friends from the bar were actually the monstrums. Hey, concern me in Sorcelled. Who are you really? You're not a doctor, are you? Hey, I told you, I'm a traveling doctor. Well, to be precise, that's not my only profession. Forgive me if I led you astray. Fine, you win. I'll tell you the truth as a reward for catching me. I'm only moonlighting as a doctor. My real profession is thievery. I travel across the entire continent in search of all sorts of treasures. Thievery? And now you've got your eyes on sudden something in Balduke. It also seems that you were previously aware of this ancient structure. That's right, little lady. Can't call myself much of a thief if I don't do my due diligence, can I? But I'll confess that even I can make a m mistake from time to time. This passage was one of the canals built during the Hundred Years' War. They were used by Norse devotees to defend people against outside threats. There's nothing of value here anymore. I can see that it's time to cut my losses. But the Monstrums, hiding with a, within a bar in plain sight. Now that's a discovery. Once I learned that Adol Kristen, the notorious adventurer, was hiding here, I was certain that the treasure I was looking for couldn't be far. So I was no more chagrined to deceive you all than you were to pursue me. I'm not sure what to say. Tell me more about the history of this place. Hmm. You really are as peculiar as they say. You're not hoping to get away from this scot-free, are you? It sounds like we'd be doing everyone a favor if we hand you over to the authorities. But she knows about us too, so... That's... Uh, so we'd be... That'd be mutual destruction. Oh, how adorably naive. You're very welcome to attempt it, love. But I can't promise that the identities of the monsters won't slip from my lips. What?! Holy shit, that's a lot of them. Watch out! Ah! That's too many boss monsters! Holy shit! These ruins appear remarkably decrepit for being hidden underground. Where did those monsters come from? Huh, these guys must have been lurking beneath the bar, huh? Maybe they're just a little thirsty. Let's put them out of their misery. Holy moly, I, one lucky flash guard and boom. Whew, that's one less thing to worry about. Wait, where'd she go? There. Where do you think you're going? You haven't even apologized yet. Haven't you caused enough trouble already? Ugh. Hey, do you guys find her? Oh, speak of the devil. 
The bar patrons and staff are doing well. They're all waking up and nobody was hurt. Thank goodness. Mission accomplished. And with that, the jig is up. Do what you will with me. Adol and his comrades returned to the Dandelion of Sarati. Eventually, the Dandelion patrons and staff all awoke and the unrest waned. Subsequently, You're after a hidden treasure of ancient Glia. That's right, it was said to be hidden by the Glian royal family during the Hundred Years' War. For 500 years, people searched for it, but after so many failures, it was disregarded as a myth. But I learned from a reliable source that it was somewhere here in Balduk. If my information is accurate, then there's upwards of ten mil uh, tens of millions in gold. Whistle. Then the objective of your expedition to Balduk was to search for this treasure. Hmm, I think I've heard about, about it before. And tell me, was it described as a myth? It wouldn't be much fun if it wasn't, right? I may be speaking for myself, but I prefer not to not living uh, my life scrunching for leftovers. You're not the least bit afraid of being caught, are you? I used to be a thief too, but I wasn't that reckless. Do you have any other leads? I wonder where the treasure is. Hey, Adol, don't let her smooth talk you and the gang involved. It might be a scam. Uh, but I guess hidden treasures are right up your alley, aren't they? When one 500 years old at that, sounds like an adventure all on its own. You have the face of a child who's just received a new toy. I knew you were easily captivated by adventure, but I didn't expect this degree of eagerness. If I did, maybe I would have fought twice. I have a small pro proposition for you, a peace offering if you please. Will you let me join your group? Okay, but you have to split your treasure. Ha, uh, hold, uh, hold it. You're in no position to make demands. And after everything you did to us. Oh, come on, I said I was sorry. I worked my frail little fingers to the bone making sure there weren't any side effects. I don't think that's the issue here. Perhaps we could consider it better after hearing your reasoning. It's simple, really. With you, I have a better chance of finding the hidden treasure. In exchange for your genera generous hospitality, I'll donate my services as a doctor. Criminals like us should stick together, right? I... She's blackmailing us. If we refuse her offer, then all we've worked for may very well be swept into the gutter. In that case, we don't have much of a choice, do we? Gosh, I should have seen this coming a mile away. Maybe it won't be so bad. Having a doctor around would be nice. I say we, lo we let her join. That seems to be the logical course of action. I discern no disadvantage in consenting to this proposal. She's not wrong, and it's the only compromise we've got. God, let her say, if we're lucky, she'll try pulling something else on us. I really hope she doesn't. Excellent, you've made the right choice. And I suppose we'll be seeing a lot more of each other from now on. Alright, that went great! All that glare is complete. Golden gloves received. New Ally Serati. She will now assist in Grimwald Knox. The break room has been repurposed into a clinic. You should go and speak with Sarati. Well, I'm glad we were able to bring that to a close so quickly. It'd, been, it'd have been over for all of us if the knights or the garrison came to investigate. We do, all, we do well to keep our guards up around that fee, this fee flow. Sure thing! Sarai's got all the signs of someone you don't turn your back to. But I have to admit we're in desperate need of her help right now. What do you want to make? That should do it. <laughs> Good work out there. Hello there. <laughs> I'm relieved that her intention wasn't to poison us with that concoction. And I can scarcely be upset after coming out of it with an experienced apothecary. I don't suppose she'd be willing to teach me. It actually is... Marked on the map, but I can't teleport anywhere. There's still an event I have to worry about, huh? Are you sure it's a good idea to let Sarati join us? I don't know if we can forgive her yet, or maybe I'm just, still just mad I fell for it. Either way, I think we should be careful about trusting her. It would be really helpful having a doctor around, but to be honest, I don't feel completely comfortable trusting Sarati yet. Oh, we can go to the underpass whenever we want now. My my, miss me already? Come pay me a visit anytime you need some medicine, or if you're lonely. And if you come across any medicine, medical formulae, 
Do deliver them to me, would you? Okay. I'm sure an adventurer like yourself could benefit from more medicines. I look forward to seeing you soon, handsome. <laughs> Suppose I should start cozying up to you people now we're all partners in crime. Maybe I'll start with that girl who just got back. She didn't miss out on all the fun. Oh, we take care up there. Use map to travel again. Okay. Oh, you brought me a medical formula, have you? It's an old one too. Most people would have a tough time deciphering something so esoteric. But luckily, lucky for you, a doctor slash peep like myself isn't exactly most people. I can brew it for you whenever you like. Just make sure you bring the ingredients. Vigor formula. Well, hello there, Adam. Boost potion, but verdant leaf is really hard to get, I guess. Adam. My muscles have been aching lately, so when Sarai came in with that medicine, I'm embarrassed just thinking about it. Say the word and I'll make it. Hey, so... Miss Sarai fooled me too. She smells like trouble, the cool foxy kind, you know, because foxes are sly. I'm gonna ask her to teach me to be like that too. Bye bye See you later! God, usually someone buys me a drink before selling me down the river. But if it helps pass the time, I don't mind being entertained every once in a while. <laughs> I'm glad things with Sarati have ironed out. Apologizing to our customers is not an undertaking I'll soon miss. I'll have Sarati work overtime as redress. Since I'm a doll, the sedative had no effect on me. You find Parks appeared to be, uh, be in a peaceful sleep. I too wish to experience how it feels to sleep. This is what I returned to after finishing that errand the creepy mask lady had me do. <laughs> I leave for a second and you people cannot even defend the bar on your own. And the culprit is an outlaw of a bounty. As if we'd not have enough of those. <laughs> I can't believe she made me sleep in the kitchen. She knows her stuff, I'll give her that. But I'll still need to watch out for her. The smoking rain from out of town treated me to a drink, and I never say no to that. But before I knew it, both her and the time had flown me right by. Did I fall asleep or something? Man, talk about blowing it. I was having the most pleasant little trip through dreamland just now. Am I really so old that I'll nod off right in the middle of a meal? Dear me, I must have been so exhausted that I dozed off. Chante apologized to me, unnecessary as it was. There's no use writing over it. A sleepy spell hit me hard there. I ended up conking out before I knew it. Guess I must be more exhausted than I realized. Monsters, the time is nigh. Under the red moons, the wicked and the defiant shall be punished. Ascend into this unbreaking night. Unsheathe your curse and smite the darkness. I can make the fur eye to detect lacrimae through walls. Crimson Wine! Let's do this, everyone! Here I go. Gotcha. Stop Stop me. Round what are you doing? Round and round. Round and round. Shatter to space. Round and round. Shatter to space. Round and round. Shatter to space. I don't think you can swing the lid on that. Let's keep you around. My time to shine. Where are you going? Ah, Play. I'm you are leaving it to me. Ah. Oh, 
Oh fuck, Lord and Knight, where? There. Oh, it's close. But the enemies are still fucking me up. Uh, uh, what? Did I get S rank at least? Things are a little chaotic there. Impressive. I didn't realize I could lay all these tra bear traps around them. S rank. Okay, never doing it again. No less from all of you. Excellent work, everyone. Hmm. Strike talisman. Now I can explore wherever's in up there. Barrier lifted prison outskirts. Wait, an azure pill right on the rocky uh, path here. There. <laughs> we did it. What? You here visit an inmate? Visitation dates and times are determined by the governor general's office. If and only if you have an appointment, we'll open the gates on high alert. Confirm your appointment at the office and come back then. Got it. New, new location discovered. Prison. A prison entrance gate. Perhaps I will understand someday. Ah, oh, there's a barrier here, even though we've been able to get into prison before. Hey, some treasure. Strength elixir. I hereby entrust the might of my sword within the seal. Rise, valiant hero. Carry forth that which precedes me and prosper. Mysterious power was up within at all. Crimson King got strength and defense, okay. <laughs> Didn't think I'd find one for Adol himself. Two thousand gold. Pedal. Seeing a renegade go by gets me all fired up every time. Screw the hieroglyph church, it's Nora's all the way for me. The cemetery? <laughs> we did it! That is weird. I got two pills from the cemetery despite not truly having access to the place yet. Aha, blue petal. Alright! <laughs> Another blue petal here. Got it! Item up Another Azure petal? Hmm. Hey, some treasure. Mushroom. Item acquired. Oh, nice Azure Petal there. Almost didn't see it. Hey, some treasure. Defense elixir times two. <laughs> oh, there's something here. Two pedals. Item acquired. Hey, some treasure. Bitter remedy. Whew, this shop really wears you down to the bone. My back hurts something fierce. Hold it, the mines are just ahead, and only authorized personnel are allowed in. Let me make it clear to you, we're not looking for any no new hires right now. Aside from us contractors, 
We get all the work we need from the prisoners. What, you really think we're starving for work enough to come this dump? Sorry about him. Thanks for all your hard work. We'll just be going back now. You don't have to worry about us getting in the way. Huh? Hey, hold on a sec, Lair. You're Pendleton's kid, aren't you, Aincha? Sorry for not recognizing you. Most folk who come here come looking for work. You let them off with a kind word and they come back every time. It's a real problem. Here, how about I teach you this recipe as my way of saying sorry? I learned from my at my favorite restaurant. It's easy. Plus, it fills you right up. Try it out. Potage. Oh, thank you very much. And sorry for the trouble again. Oh, uh, where can you be? How should I find? Hero History of Heroes Lost in the Waves of Time. Hmm, I still can't find a thing. Maybe I should try looking at things from a different perspective. I see it. Alright, I think that's the final blue petal of the outskirts area. This was a little suspect. It must have been repaired not too long ago. And they did a pretty shy job from the looks of it. It is most definitely hollow within. I can sense a room just beyond. The, the thing that made that roar might be in there then. It's just like Kratos said. Hey cowgirl, why don't you whip out that gift of yours? What, you want me to knock it down? It's not like the garrison or the knights are tripping over themselves to patrol here. No one's gonna come marching out over a little noise. Well, sure, but this thing's so old, I'd probably just destroy the whole thing. Then go easy on it. You got a lot of nerve telling me that, Kratos. Alright, let's smash this thing. Stay clear of the breeze, everyone. Wow. I wish it would just auto-charge your weapon instead, though. But then again, that would use a gift gauge, so that maybe that's not such a good thing. Damn, it's like you were made for this. Hey, you know it. We should be able to explore within these ramparts now. Shall we proceed? Hmm. Breakable walls can be seen with a third eye. This rampart has been here since the Hundred Years' War, right? For a structure more than half a century in its age, its interior is surprisingly clean. Last I heard, the Romans have been keeping the place tidy. My guess says they want it on hand as a stronghold in case of a revolt. So what kept us safe from the outside will be used to keep us in. I don't like that one bit. Man, so the victor is going to spoil, so that's just how it is, like it or not. Returning to the subject at hand, what manner of roar was it you heard? I had been unable to detect it over the cheering of the crowd. Was that... Kah, answer enough for ya? It appears to be coming from further inside. Yufa? Alright, let's get this show on the road. The sooner we find this thing, the sooner we make sure this never happens again. I got Sorry. this! We better activate this healing point. Yup. That wall appears to be damaged. Time for my gift to shine. Aha. Assassination. Panacea. Okay. Oh, man. What the? Oh, I did it! Leave it to me! I'll handle this! That was a tough one to platform. Holy moly! I got this! There's a bunch of scary looking dudes. Let's go! I'll handle this! Oh, that was a tough one to get. Took some crazy platforming. Boost potion. Actually, I wonder, can I actually get there just by jumping from this level? Huh. 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 
I would have actually still have barely enough gas in order to get there. I wouldn't actually have to jump off that ledge like I did back there. Okay. Okay. I think there's something here. Soul Lumber. Yeah. Well. Hey, some treasure. For me and Cuticle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't hold a charge when dashing upwards. Oh, there we go. Weird. That was very awkward. Yellow shawl obtained. Okay. Whoa, a discovery point. N nice, I can get Crimson Spar here. Colossal Windhole Deposit. What is extraordinary about this place? Still mostly giving me sh not good stuff. Hmm. There we go. 1400 gold. It's a lot of stuff. Yeah, this stuff does not fall very quickly, does it? Sturdy Grimoire. Chambers must be ancient. The whole place is falling apart. I'll smash through everything that gets in our way. You seem to be enjoying yourself, Yufa. Whoa, a treasure chest. Crimson Spar. What the? Something with the Mar Anemona? Not in particular, we have merely been walking for quite some time now. That's true, we should still be inside the city, though. Well, considering the direction we've been heading, I'd say we're somewhere around the cliffs near the prison by now. Wouldn't be surprising given how long we've been walking. I see, that makes sense. Wait, then, what was that Rory... Uh, the, was that Rory heard coming from inside the prison? Well, let's have to find out. The plot thickens. Haha, <laughs> must be some pet if they've got uh, locked up in here, there. The prison, huh? Look! What a beautiful view! Oh, the city looks tiny from here. Except your house, Krisha. It's huge! Valkyrie Hammer! Tiger Claw! Alright, the boss can summon those ant enemies, but of course they get, you can use them to get a little bit of extra boost gauge if you manage to kill them. And if you finish off with a skill, you get multiple skill finishes that way too. Alright, it's best to attack in the front even though it's more dangerous that way since the boss's weak point is the face. Attacking from the side and behind will do very little damage. Even if it is a little bit safer in some ways. Yeah, I guess the cannons are made of way sturdier stuff than the face. And the boss can even summon those really sh uh, hard rocks that you have to break with Yufa's charge attack. Yeah. 
Yeah, I only did 13 damage on the cannon itself. Ow. I got lucky there with its with its projectile attack. Yeah, if you d if you attack from the front, you can probably get to l less than half health before you can even fill up the stun gauge. Otherwise, you'll still fill up the stun gauge faster. Or I mean, well, you'll f you'll do damage slower than you fill up the stun gauge, rather. St I think stunning is always the same no matter which part you attack. It's gonna boost now since it's almost stunned, and hopefully I can get some good damage in before it unstuns itself. Oh, that was close! That laser almost got me! The very last laser at the end. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in to this Let's Play of Ease 9 Monstrum Nox. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit that bell icon.